Hi everyone, Hannah here. Welcome back to my channel for another video. Now, as you guessed from the title, this video is a fall decor haul. I um, have wanted to get some bits for my house for a while and I haven't got round to it, of course I haven't, but I did, I finally did. I managed and I went over three stores. I've gone to B&M, Home Bargains, and of course, I wouldn't be me if I didn't hit up TK Maxx. So, um, this is going to be the things that I bought on that haul, and it's just what I'm then going to do with them around my home. So, if you hear anything in the background during this um, video, it is because my girls are actually having a bath at the moment, because this is while Glenn is home, because this is the only time I've managed to film this video today. <laughs> I'm going to start with B&M first. Now most of these are just like little inspirational things um, and they are going to get like switched up. While we're here at this house um, they are going to alternate um, in one specific little corner. Like I'll change them out like weekly or bi-weekly. Um, but then when we actually move house then they will each get their own home and things in a specific part of the house but yeah so first item is this hanging sign it says a house is built on bricks and beams a home is built on hopes and dreams now things like this I absolutely love um, I've got in the middle of um, a photo frame that is in my living room is um, another one similar to this I can't actually remember what it says but um, yeah it things like this I absolutely love. Next thing is I've got three of these. They're all they all say something different, but the look of them um is identical pretty much. Um and the first one says she believed she could, so she did. Second one is never let anyone dull your sparkle. This one is more for AD than it is for me. It's going to be that she can have this one um in her new room when we move um and then it links in they're just like oh no you've got yours and mummy's got hers and then this one is my favorite it says give a girl the right shoes and she can conquer the world love this one um however i'm still trying to find the right pair of shoes because i'm so heavy footed i can't wear heels I end up, like my feet end up hurting after half an hour <laughs> Next one is just um, a nice little plaque that I found to, again, go next to the um, house and home one. Um, and it's just two hanging butterflies. Bottom one's just got this lovely rose pattern on it. Um, but the top one says, have courage and be kind. And I just, I think this is actually really beautiful. So again, this is going to go on the wall um, in a specific little corner. And the last thing that I got from B&M, which I was actually really excited to find, um, because I'm hoping that having it actually out on display will help me and things as well, um, because I've seen that Emily Norris has something similar, and it just it seemed like a really good idea to me, and then I went and found one. So, yeah, it is literally just the, this chalkboard that says this week, and then it's got the week on it, and this is going to live in my kitchen and it is going on I'm going to put um, what we're having for dinner on this every night so this is going to be my meal plan board so yes I'm very excited to actually do this and I'm very curious to see as to whether or not I will stick to what meals I put on this as well and it even came with a bit of chalk as well which was very handy because I actually would have forgotten to buy some if it didn't come with any Next, I'll move on to um, Home Bargains. I only picked up a few things from Home Bargains, um, but they are things that can work with things that I've already got as well, so I thought that was nice. Um, I picked up these two um, little hanging hearts. Um, they're meant to be for Christmas, as you can probably tell by the colours on the love one. But I saw the silver one first, which says hope, and I absolutely love that. So I just, I got these two, um, and I'm just, I'm not necessarily going to hang them. I might do, I haven't fully decided yet, but I can just like prop them 
up against some of the other things that I've got. So that's those. I also did get a third one um, because I like my threes, but this one um, will obviously come down during the new year. But it, again, a silver one that just says Merry Christmas. And I thought that was really sweet. So yeah, there's those. The next few items are ones that I will be using on top of um, our cereal cabinet and where and I'm going to be turning that corner into um, like a little video corner hopefully because um, I'm actually really happy with all of this stuff that I found and it's managed to make it so I can clear that corner and sort it all out and I'll actually like put everything up how I want it to be so first of all I found this calendar and I absolutely love ones like this um, so yeah it's just like a little wooden blocked calendar with the numbers and the month as well and I just love the fact that it's white and silver I absolutely love silver I really do I don't know if you're starting to tell because I'm realizing that white and silver is actually a bit of a theme with everything that I've got so yeah that's my little calendar I went and found this big plate which is one that is going to be underneath quite a few things um, so yeah I found this and it's plastic as well so I have no worries if um, Elena accidentally bashes it or somehow because this is my house it falls off so yeah I've got this one and then also to go on top of that I have this little star plate which I thought was so cute. They did have a bigger one of this, um, but I prefer the little one and things. So this, the big plate and my calendar all go together. It's also going to have my oil diffuser on it as well in that little corner, um, which I'm very much looking forward to setting up. Um, and the last thing from Home Bargains, which I, Oh, I was so happy that I found and they do have some more so I might go back and get another string I'm not sure yet but it is rose LED lights and they are battery powered as well so these are going to go again in that little corner that I'm making and they're gonna go up against the wall so yeah I was so happy I found these it really was I saw some at my cousin Chris's wedding um, but he'd found his on eBay and I, just, I hadn't got around to buying any and then here I was in home bargains and I was like I will be having a box of them please. Last few bits I got were from TK Maxx and um, they kind of work together while they don't at the same time so I'm hoping that it's going to look alright once I put it all together but first of all it starts with that I found and I think this is cute this silver long acorn plate um, now I actually really like this so this is going to go on my windowsill um, and it's going to have a few other things I'm about to show you on it as well and it's just going to be just like this nice little display um, on my windowsill so yeah um, the things that are going on that also are I literally have been searching for these for a little while and I hadn't managed to find anything. I was actually rather upset that I wasn't, hadn't been able to find anything. But then by pure chance, I managed to find them and I managed to find myself two little squirrels, a red squirrel and a gray squirrel together. And I was just like, I will be having both of them, please. So yeah, I absolutely adore these. I think they are so cute. So they will be sitting, of course, on the acorn. Um, and things like that, not necessarily just like that, um, on my windowsill. I also picked up this little um, faux plant to go on there as well. Um, and I absolutely just love the colours of this. So yeah, that's going to be going in the corner as well. Um, I picked up two of these little, um, I think they're meant to be tea light holders. However, I'm not going to be using them for tea lights. Again, they'll go on the windowsill, um, or one of them might go on top of the um, on top of the breakfast unit. 
because these are the perfect size to put our collection of hairbands in. So, well, I say collection of hairbands, we're running out of hairbands, I need to buy some more. So, yeah, one for me, one for AD, slash Elena. But, yes, so that's what those will be used for. Last but not least, the th um, last thing I bought is this, um, like, craft box, which says, be happy on it. And the reason I love this is because we did have some wicker baskets um, on our breakfast unit and on our windowsill and things, which knickknacks got thrown into. And they are still knickknacks that, I, that I'll need and that we will need to access and things like this that we're going to keep using. However, I don't just... The, it just seems to overflow and things like that. So I'm hoping that by putting it in this instead, because it's got the lid and things, that it'll be that I won't be able to just put things on top of it and they'll just fall off and things like that. It'll be that I'll have to, it'll be the deliberate effort of take the lid off, put it in there, and then in that time that I'm doing that, it'll be like, do I actually need to keep this thought that I can work with? So yes that is going to help tidy up that corner immensely. So, yeah, that was my fall decor haul from my three stores. And yeah, I am looking forward and I hope everything turns out ho how it looks in my head. <laughs> so, yes, thank you so much for watching this video. If this is the first time of clicking onto my, onto my videos, welcome. Um, I post new videos once or twice a week depending on how hectic my week gets so please hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date with any new videos that I post and if you've liked this video please give it a thumbs up. So yes, thank you all again for watching guys and I will catch you in my next video. Bye!